Hey guys, it's our viewer. Okay, we got it. This is awesome. This is my favorite phone so far that's been out from Verizon. Blackberry Storm, but we will. But today, forget the Blackberry Storm, forget the Samsung Omnia, Voyager. This phone is probably my favorite. I already told you that out of all of them. Got touchscreen on the front, keyboard. And VCast, which, you know, with the TV. And this is the new titanium one. I wonder if it's different, even though after the color. Maybe it's like slimmer or something. Let's find out what's in the package. We have a, the Voyager, of course, VCast multimedia phone. Standard battery, travel charger, USB cable and CD, user guide, and a quick reference guide. Okay, got your CD on how to use it. it. comes with every phone you buy at Verizon. shows you how to use the VCast with Rhapsody. Tips, hints, and shortcuts, and it'll say the phone, the bottom left, LG Voyager. User guide, LG Voyager. And a quick start guide with handsets and other accessories. A Spanish version of the Quick Start Guide for all these people who speak Spanish. And a, another Spanish thing. I don't know what it is. This thing is. Oh, it's just like a user guide. Ooh, oh man. Wow, I'm just gonna keep on this little flap so you can't see it, my phone. Way. Okay, I'm serious. Look at that. Look how nice that is. Oh my gosh, I'm full touch screen. Wow. That's going to be fun to play with later. USB cord. And if you're wondering, why didn't he show the charger? My friend has the charger because he needed it really bad. But if you want, some people just like to see what the box looks like. There you go. Alright, well, let's look at the hardware first, since we've seen the box, we've seen what's in the box. Alright, on the front, full touch screen, I really do not know how long it is because I'm not that smart. Send, clear, and microphone, and then end key on the end, that's also a power key, and on the inside, Full keyboard, and that is not a touch screen. The inside is only that is. But you also have send and end keys on the front. I mean, inside, sorry. Clear, and a, um, what's it called? Speaker, below. And on the sides, you have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Micro SD slot, right there. And... A, the picture button on the side, it's on the left side, you're right, a lock button, and the speaker volume right there on the side. They do, alright, let's turn the sucker on. It doesn't have the best boot time in the world, but... I mean, it's pretty fast. I wouldn't be angry with it or anything. The storm is a whole different deal. Don't even talk to me about that thing. I'm just going to give you a quick overview of the touchscreen part. And you have at the bottom, message, call, menu, and contacts. And the contacts, good thing about that is you can scroll through them. And... They have this certain ability at the top, A through I, J through P, Q through Z, and numbers, and signals and all that. You can, if you want to say you want to get to C, go A, B, C, and it brings up C. And I will show you how to call. 865, wait, no. 86, what is that number? Oh, yeah. 
eight six seven five three zero oh, nine e nine. Eight six seven five three zero oh, nine e nine. Okay. All right, that's the phone. It does have haptic feedback, as you notice. I will show you messaging on the front too. And it's cool. Any you can do every menu, every browser, watching TV. You can do everything you can do on here in here. See, it switches automatically wherever you were before. But I will text from the front and then I will move on to the next part. Okay. Now let's start texting on the front. The gray fox jump over the white fence. You can see that it's really easy to text on on the front too as well as on the back. Alright, now we've done the touch screen part. Keyboard time. Gives you the same menu you have on your touch screen, just a little wider. And it's horizontal, but I'll show you messaging with the keyboard. Okay. The gray fox jumped over the white fence and chased the black cow that was a lot faster than the touch screen because I've used this a lot you have to get used to the keyboard if you've never used a keyboard before but once you do wow you can text fast all right you can also call from this part you can dial it'll go to speakerphone Oh, I can't. 1 800. Alright. Call Safe Auto to prove the speaker. Thank you for calling Safe Auto Insurance Company. For quality assurance, this call may be recorded. So that proves that you can talk through here because you see the speakers. And contacts, same thing. You can set a picture. And probably turn turn speaker off. And if you're wondering how I got the black thing, because if you get it, it'll be connected as the white theme. You go to settings, display, display themes, white. I mean black. This phone is great. I love it. I use it all the time. I use it for work. I use it for everything. It's the, like the most easiest phone. Like the touch screen, pretty much the same thing as the Dare. The Dare is just a little bit more advanced than the touch screen. It just has more haptic feedback, like an inch more. This is way better. You can even get TV. Free month of TV if you buy it. But LG Voyager. For Verizon Wireless, great phone. I give it a five out of five stars, and I recommend it for heavy texters or people who want to text fast. All right, thanks for watching my review of the LG Voyager. Remember, go to our website www.ireviewer.tk. You can give like comments and blog and we have a registration form you can fill out so you can register for our site and remember you name it we review it i review it